Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back after a week of vacation. So let's get cracking. Friends, right now we are starting on my webpage, and that's because I want to highlight something for you. Right down here under the Tinkercad Fab 5 is the Tinkercad Shape Catalog. Friends, as you can see, these are screenshots of all the shapes and they have the names. I'm gonna show you in a minute just why those names are a little more cool. Friends, before I do that though, I wanna click these dots and I wanna show you how to make a copy so that you can keep your very own set of this forever. Once you give it a new name, it'll be saved to your Google Drive, and just like that, you've got all the shapes with their names. Now, friends, I mentioned this because of one awesome new thing that has been added to Tinkercad. If you click the search button right there, and let's say you type heart and press enter, it will show you the heart options that are available. You can choose how you want to sort them, relevance, popular, or newest, and then you can just track them down. If you want to see different kinds of cubes, type in your search. Notice it does not show me all the cubes, but it does show me a cube. Friends, I think the beauty of this is you can actually see the shapes to get an idea of what you want to build with. So if we take the swept NASA, I'm going to switch real quick back to Tinkercad. If we click on the search button and type swept, it does not show up. If we switch to shape generators, boom, there it does. That's how you need to switch between them to find the ones you want. Friends, I do also want to highlight this last page where I've got grid paper here. You can use this as a template. You can draw, you can design, you can give sticky notes to yourself for what you're trying to build. Just giving yourself tips. And if you want more of these, you can just hit the next arrow and it gives you another one. And then set the background to the grinded grid paper or whatever it is you're trying to design. Another huge bonus is once you make one of these, you can share it with anybody else by simply clicking the share button and creating a link that you send to somebody else so you can actually work together on your projects. So friends, real quickly and wrapping up, so glad that Tinkercad has this search feature in here. Just make sure you also pick the correct area that you want to search through. Of course, friends, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Of course, if you got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.